thank you to everybody who has made the journey here. It just means so much to us as we've been going around tonight and talking to people, seeing friends, family, loved ones, kids, grandparents from all different walks of our lives. It has truly been nostalgic to say the least. The two of us couldn't be here without everybody else. So here's to you. Olivia, since the day that you curled up on the floor of my office and fell asleep, I knew that I loved you. You have a spirit and drive that I admire and am inspired by every single day. You stand up for yourself and for your beliefs, and I will always stand there beside you in support of them. Michael, when we first started talking, you almost sounded too good to be true. You're a surfer, a musician, a skydiver, a teacher, and a chef. And somehow, here I am, marrying the coolest person I have ever met. Mike called me and asked if he could bring a girl named Liv that he's been dating. Mike then went on to tell me about how she's from Pennsylvania, she's been hunting, she's been fishing, and I was like, Mike, she sounds cooler than you. <laughs> then I met Liv and was able to talk to her for a while, and Mike, she is cooler than you. I remember telling Jules before our first date that I felt like I was about to meet the man I was going to marry, just based on the way you made me feel so special and so happy, even over the phone. He just lets me know that everything's like gonna be okay and there's no need to worry and stress over little things. And I feel like that has really like made me more relaxed and happy in everything I do. I knew that for her, he was different than anything that had come before. Hindsight is 2020, and I should have seen it coming because I knew they were going to get married. It was just a matter of when. After our first date, somehow I knew that a second date would become a third date and had hoped that someday we would end up where we are here today. I do think that everything happens for a reason, and yes, yeah, some things might be a coincidence, but I think that the people who are meant to be in your life are tied to you by an invisible string, and you'll find them when you need them the most. You look great. I remember the first time Olivia brought an intense sense of play, humor, and dancing to a Collingswood Christmas parade. It was her first time meeting the family. My wife, Michael's sister, responded with, she is fun. She's perfect for my brother. To see someone who I've come to love so much be so loved, not only by myself, but also my family, and fit right in with all of the antics and the banter, is one of the greatest things that I have ever known. You look amazing. Thank you. I love you. I love you. They say you become a collection of the people you surround yourselves with, your friends you choose, your families you're blessed with. Wow. So nice. Wow. I might need a crazy. I have tissues in here too. Oh. <laughs> That's amazing. This is why I'm marrying you. This is amazing. Take a look around and just think about all the love that these people gave you that made you into the people that you are today. Michael and Olivia will mark their transition as a couple, not only between themselves, but by also celebrating the love between all of us, including the love of their parents, siblings, extended family, friends, and their loved ones who are no longer with us today. As your wife, I promise to always be whatever it is you need me to be. I promise to always come surfing with you, even if I'm not that good, <laughs> so that we can experience the calm mornings and peaceful ocean together. You've turned me into a Jersey girl. We've become the proudest dog parents to our Bubba. All of those experiences hold some of my favorite memories together. They say love is never a perfect thing. It is something that together we must nurture and build. You are the only person in the world that I want to go on this journey of growth with. Not just now in the present moment, although I certainly do, but forever and always. We have a long and exciting road ahead of us, and I am humbled to be beside you every step of the way. Take a minute and look around. Take in this moment, 
Take in this place, this frozen instant in time. Witness the people that love you most, that have helped mold you into who you are and what you most adore about each other. God has brought them together. They have each been a blessing to their friends and families. As the maker of all things, thank you for this glorious day and the love of all gathered here. When you decide to get married, you're not only marrying your person, but their family as well. Olivia has always told me that she knows Michael is the man that he is today because of his family. And after spending time with the Myras over the past year, I couldn't be happier knowing that they love her as much as I do. I don't know if I'm gonna freak out about it. <laughs> I blinked and the little boy who wrapped himself around my leg as I walked is today a young man married. Olivia is the daughter I did not have the rigors of parenting, but get to enjoy as an adult. Olivia is the perfect human being for Michael. When I reflect on the life that we've lived together so far, I'm swimming in a wellspring of warmth and joy. When I look at you, I get an overwhelming feeling of comfort, love, and giddiness. Your smile is infectious, and when you get to the point of breathless laughter, I simply fall in love with you even more. Olivia has really taught me to look forward just to the future, being more accountable with uh, myself and her and everything in our everyday lives together. Michael and Olivia, you were great people on your own, but it's clear to me that you are better people as right. one. No, that is awesome. Yeah. That is like straight 70s. One of the many things I love about your relationship is your ability to have fun and be silly. I want you guys just to remember, always be those kids on bicycles, always jump off docks, always catch waves together. Just keep those little kids and you alive. Marrying you means getting to marry my best friend and getting to continue to grow our little family together. I officially get to become part of your amazing family a family who has loved me and treated me like one of their own since the day I unexpectedly showed up to their shore house. <laughs> this is truly just like a very surreal experience. I thought I would be more nervous. The lace is so pretty. It's yeah. got Nana's wedding dress. I thought this would be like a lot more, I don't know, just like scary, but it's so incredible and I feel so warm and so full. I can't wait to party with everyone, and so let's go. Thanks to you, I already have everything that I've ever dreamed of and more, but I know that somehow our lives will continue to get bigger and better. I feel so blessed and thankful that you chose me to be your wife, and I am so lucky that I get to go through life with you. With the power vested in me and with the trust and love of all of you here today, I now pronounce you Mr. and Mrs. Michael Myra. You may kiss the bride. With whatever our future may hold, be it a few more dogs, some children, many children, or something in between, I will always be there to hold your hand and tell you that I love you because I've never spoken truer words. I am humbled to be your husband and to set out on our life together. You are my first, my last, my everything, my sunshine. Olivia Leventry, I promise to always love you with all of my heart.